I know you guys are wondering why I'm uploading so late, and why I'm in a custom game. Well, the Season 1 preload has just dropped, and we have access to all of the Season 1 weapons that are going to be available, and we can also check out Shoot House. So this video is going to give you guys a preview of all of the Season 1 weapons and Shoot House, that way you know what to expect when the season officially launches at 9 a.m. Eastern Time tomorrow. So, let's jump right into it. Alright, so here is the M13 returning from Modern Warfare 19, but with kind of a different approach on it. So let's see how it goes. And first of all is- oh. And also, look at Shoot House. They really redid the design on this map. Let's check out what they did to Junk. Okay, looks like they kind of changed it up a little bit. Does this line of sight still exist? Ooh, it does. And also, I'm going to be using these weapons without any attachments. That, you know, that way you know what to expect. Oh, I just lagged. That way you know what to expect whenever you actually get hands on these guns yourself. All right, so this is the M13. This gun doesn't look like it's going to be too bad. It's got a pretty fast rate of fire, just like it did in Modern Warfare 19. And overall, I think this is going to be a pretty fun weapon to use in SMD whenever I get the chance to. Although I feel like with the fast rate of fire, you might need an extended mag on this thing, just like in Modern Warfare 19. Can't be whiffing those, Tyler. Okay, there we are. Are you able to climb on this? You can. So here is the Bass P that is also going to be launching with the new season. Let's see how it performs. Tyler, you can't be whiffing your shots, bro. Especially on bots. Ooh, wow. This thing melts if you hit him in the head. But what if you hit him in the body? Okay. This thing seems pretty good, too. But again, this is another gun that has a pretty fast rate of fire, so you might need an extended mag on this as well. But overall, this is looking pretty solid. And finally, here is the Victus XMR, the new sniper that's also going to be dropping with the new season. And if I'm going to be honest with you, this thing kind of gives off the L96A1 vibes from Modern Warfare 3, if you remember that sniper. But let's see how this performs. First of all, how's the ADS? Ooh, this is looking kind of slow. You're definitely going to need some attachments to boost that one up. Okay, how's the rechamber? similar to a Modern Warfare 19 sniper. It's kind of slow, but let's see. Ooh, okay. Okay, this sniper seems like it's going to be a pretty fun one to use as well. It kind of looks like an L96, like I said, but it also kind of performs like the AX50 from Modern Warfare 19. And I know everybody loves using the AX in Modern Warfare 19. So they're probably going to really like this sniper too. Okay, now unfortunately you aren't able to load in with the Chimera or the Honey Badger, but you'll actually be able to use them in the firing range. So we're going to head over to the firing range and check out the Honey Badger right now. All right, so here is the Honey Badger in Modern Warfare 2, or the Chimera as they call it. Let's see the rate of fire. Okay. Pretty fast rate of fire there, so you might need an extended mag if that's your style. How's the recoil? I'm not going to control it. Okay, that doesn't seem too bad. It seems pretty easy to control. But how about how many shots to kill? I'm aiming at the upper chest on this guy here. One, two, three, four. Okay, so it's a four-shot kill at close range like that. What about over at that range? One... Two, three, four. Okay. With a rate of fire like this, this seems like a pretty fast killing gun. But what about at that distance? One, two, three, missed. Four, five, six. And with this recoil, ooh, we got a little bit of side to side recoil too, so that's gonna be a tough challenge at that type of range. But, if you have attachments that help with your recoil, that shouldn't be much of an issue. Alright, that is going to do it for this quick little preview on all four of the Season 1 weapons and Shoot House in Modern Warfare 2. 
Hope you guys enjoyed it and got a little taste of what to expect. I'm going to leave you guys with what all four of the mastery camos look like on all four of these weapons. So, that's going to do it for me. And I hope to catch you guys over on Twitch whenever I'm grinding these camos and playing SMD with these weapons. Twitch.tv slash TylerJedi. Link is in the pinned comment. Hope to catch you guys then. Peace out.